Welcome back to Great Day Washington. Here again is the Rock Shop School of Music Performers. Take it away. Nice job. That was great. Pat Summers is doing oh, such an incredible so job. And Janine, come on over here with me. Thanks. You're you're the parent of one of the kids here. Tell us who is your kid? Who is uh, Mine is student? John, the keyboardist. Hi, John. You did a great job. Everybody did. These students are incredible. Yeah. Tell us a little bit about John and when he got started in music and uh, what other instruments that he plays. Oh, sure. John's situation is a little different. His siblings are all much older. So he grew up literally with music being played in the house, either by human performance or on the... Um, a human CD performance. Human performance. <laughs> you know, we didn't need the baby Mozart CDs. We'd stick him in his little bouncy chair by his brother playing piano. Music does so much to people. It does. And the school that he, I mean, he goes to Pat Summers School. He does. So what's that like? Is it an experience and, you know, he comes home from, from school every day and just loves it? What's the, what's the feedback? Um, no one ever has to ask John to practice. So, That's awesome. Yeah. So he's been taking lessons for a long time and we're more recently with the rock shop. Um, but just... The group, it, the kids are just, nobody has to ask them to practice. The, the and the classes are wonderful, the right? They are wonderful. Um, with Pat, he's always striving for musical excellence. He nurtures their desire to perform. And with Kellen, especially in the group, he's teaching them empathy, how to engage the autistic kids and how to bring more of them into the group and how to foster relationships with them. Can we get, that is awesome. And what, what a testimony to, to you, Pat. Come on over here. You're still mic'd up, right? Yes, I am. Okay. Um, so I want to make sure that folks at home know who Kellen is, you know, why you started your whole music school, and just tell us a little bit more about your story, how it came to be. Um, I actually decided that I was going to retire from the music business when... Kellen was born, and at three years old, th I was told that he was autistic. And when you find that out, you kind of get a little sad, and that kind of it thing changes your life. Changes your entire life. It changes your whole view of what's going on in the world, of what your future is. And you turned that around, and you started a school. Yeah. I mean, and and for children like your son, who is mm -hmm. autistic and is really mm -hmm. thriving through music, Absolutely. but also like Janine's son, who is just thriving through music mm -hmm. on his own because he has this love for it. Yeah, so, he does. You know, why that program? Because um, I noticed that Kellen was starting to talk to me through mu through music. The only way that we could talk to each other was through music in the beginning. There was no talk. There was no talking mm. except through that and through lyrics and music. 
he started talking. How many people are in your school? Like, it's, think, a, it's a big school, right? Well, we have, we, have, we have a fairly big school of 18 kids now, right? And then I teach the autistic children on the side. Mm -hmm. And when they're ready to perform, we bring them on in. How's the camaraderie? Amazing. Yeah. My, I have the best. It's, fa it's family. So last night, it was a challenge. We had to cut the songs. A nine-minute song, it's a two minutes, right? Two, into two. And Callan is a perfectionist. He's, if anyone's setting the bar for how, what the music will be, it's him. He wanted to sing it just like Rick Springfield. And then when he was done, he <laughs> wanted, did I do it right? Did I do it right? I, and everyone, they and just like started clapping for him and cheering him on. But, so it yeah. is family oriented. Which, by the way, Rick Springfield's manager and himself are watching today. So we want really? to give a shout out for letting us In our this. audience. That's right. That's right. So, we want to say thank you. And it's all yeah. thanks to you and to and to you with, with your son and, and to all the kids here and, and their parents that are in the audience as well. We're really excited that you're here thank and you that you're so sharing much. your story yeah. because I'm and sure it's inspiring others. Yeah. There, is, there, is, there is hope through music, you know, and we are here also to help parents Absolutely. who need help with that. And we are here and we are, we are, we're here. And just we're grateful for those old photos that you sent us with Steven Tyler so we can embarrass you just a little bit. That's thanks, right. You can, thanks, Pat, again for coming Thank you very much. It was a pleasure. Pleasure to see you too, Janine. Thank too. you. Thank you.